Why do you care the wedding date so much? Haven't you heard? Pick up a good date for a wedding. After that, no good life. Yeah, I also heard marriage is the tube of love. So why do people get married? Hi, I'm Miss Wei. People rush into marriage for various reasons and live in different kinds of versions of marriage. In this video, I will talk about all the possible reasons of why people get married as I have collected. If anyone got to, give me a sum up. Reason 1. Social and cultural inertia. Just do it. For the majority, people just do it by age. According to different kind of marriage law in different countries, citizens are allowed to get married at early 20s. Even in some African countries, just at 16 or 18. When you conventionally believe that you are supposed to do so and find your Mr. and Mrs. right and live a happy life forever. Well, marriage is not that simple though. This institution has been created for centuries in different ways in human civilizations. Such huge social and cultural inertia, plus the romantic imagination and the sexual impulse during young age, many rush into being couples and starting organizing families at twenties. If you stand out among people and ask why people get married, maybe someone will laugh at you. Reason 2. Heard effect. Heard effect works everywhere, including such significant life decisions. Some people get married just because other people around me also do this. In many countries and in different cultures, many people copy others' behavior, especially from their peers, colleagues, friends, classmates without enough independent thinking. Very often they feel stressful, more processly being left behind, or being isolated from other people's social life if they don't have spouses when they add to 30s or 40s. But interestingly, just as getting married, divorce also follows her effect. Hmm, watch your social circles. Reason 3. True love. If you two get married because you believe each other the Mr. and Mrs. right, well, congratulations! You must have a chance to hold a very memorable wedding with beautiful dress and, and moving marriage walls that at least can move enough you two tearful at that day. Although many psychologists will find love is like a ghost which very few seem but the most believe. Anyway, congratulations! Hold on to your fans. Reason 4. Sharing life needs and burden. Before realizing how important the loneliness to you, particularly in your spiritual life, you tend to live in a sharing and a socialized lifestyle. In marriage, people share life with each other emotionally, physically, economically, building life habits, and raise children together. Also, make themselves the role model couples in other people's eyes. Yes, sharing is a social meaning of a team and a family. If you do feel happy in this lifestyle, I'm truly happy for you. Reason 5. Health Considerations if we look broadly in human civilizations for centuries, nowadays the major countries have transformed themselves from polygamy to monogamy. Which health factors work here? Biologically, a fixed relationship helps couples block out avoidable diseases such as AIDS. Also, scientists find that compared to the singles, uh, people in marriage are more likely to keep mental and heart health as long as you are not in a toxic relationship. Reason 6. Social class flow. It's very common for some of you getting married for updating your social class or pursuing some super identities. In fact, such a tradition can stream back to a very early era. See, in 19th centuries, we can easily find this plot in Pride and the Prejudice and the Red and the Black. Nowadays, many people tend to sign prenuptial agreements before they get married. However, the marriage is not only about assets. Social circle is also a big deal. I don't think it matters any price or debauch because only the couples in the marriage know how they feel in this relationship, right? Anyway, getting married is a significant life decision for all of us. 
because it matters to whom you are living with at the most significant life moments and in which lifestyle you live. But what kind of intimate attachment and what kind of life experience created in your memory? On the other hand, marriage is not so phenomenal as many people have been brainwashed. Instead, it's an institution created by human beings with all kinds of flaws. Even some part of it can counter our human nature because our humans are not perfect. So how could we create the perfect institutions? So for whatever reasons you choose to get married, take care and try your best to create the most beautiful memories for yourself and for your better half. After all, you take a lot of precious time on picking up a good wedding date.